What is going on, guys, Marvel fans, comic book fans? We're going to be talking about Marvel's Infinity War right now. And we're only a few weeks away before the initial release, so I figured I'd go ahead and give you guys a little bit of my thoughts on who may survive this and who may not survive this. Now, my first initial thought on who may actually survive this will be Iron Man, of course. Uh, and then possibly my second theory will probably be Doctor Strange may survive as well as maybe one other character but unknown now again i can only see maybe one out of three characters surviving not the whole entire uh avenger squad i can't see you know them not surviving this because of how crazy it's gotten with everyone's like okay who's going to survive who's not going to be able to survive and honestly i think only a few are going to be able to survive this and the initial reason is because with uh thanos gathering every single infinity stone it goes into the question okay we see that loki has one we see dr strange has one we also know that in Wakeda they have one we also know that thanos i think has i think one or two of them already and then thor has one as well so a lot of them already have what the initial uh what he needs and a lot of um characters are going to be wondering okay how are we going to go up against someone that just does this powerful plus the shoulder and thanos as well so and in the trailers we see of course iron man holding on to like his helmet as well as other things now we know that he gets a, a, a um, like a suit boost or, or something with uh, the Wakita energy because we do know that Captain America gets a brand new uh, shield as well so it's actually interesting to see who is going to be uh, surviving this because since uh, it will be taking place in Wakita where uh, Black Panther uh, lives as well as his army is going to be able to help them during this time uh, it's going to be very interesting to see like all this air technology that they have at their fingertips is not going to be enough to take down Thanos or even be able to give him a challenge because of how powerful he initially is and we also need to consider um, who will not survive in this now again I do not think Captain America is going to survive I don't think Bucky's going to survive I do not think Scarlet Witch is going to survive or Black Widow or Hulk maybe or not even Spider-Man I don't even think a lot of these characters are not going to survive not because I don't want them to survive it's because of the way that the trailer is looking as well as maybe I don't even think the Guardians are going to survive if, if any of these characters somehow survive in this movie I will be completely shocked because again a lot of they, they will say I think it's been confirmed that I think uh, three-fourths of the Avengers will die I think it's been confirmed I don't know I think I don't know if that's a rumor or if it's actually been confirmed I'm really gonna have to look into that again but it goes without question of who is going to survive and who will not survive now again um, who will survive again I think the very first one is gonna be Robert Downey Jr.'s character and he's gonna have to go back in time and stop the Civil War so that way everybody can prepare for what is happening with Thanos as well as that way they're not battling against one another because all that did was cause issues and cause alliance as well as everyone trying to fight one another that did not need to be fighting to begin with and also with everyone getting killed now I think that's what's initially gonna happen is that everyone since they're on the run because at the end of Civil War, we have not seen Captain America in a very, very long time. And same thing with all the others, and even with War Machine getting hurt. So, I think it's going to be really interesting to see how they actually put all this into the movie. And into future movies to see who, who survived. And how they can go to the past and change it. And go, okay, we've done this several times. This is the wrong way. We need to come, come, come together as a team to come together as heroes. So that way we can actually fight and stop Thanos. So that way he does not kill all of us. Because if it happens again, then nobody's going to be able to survive and get a second chance. Because of the Time Stone. So more than likely the Time Stone will be used to make a second chance to, to go, okay, you know, they didn't work the first time. Let's try to see this time. Let's see if I do this. Maybe it will help with the mission. So anyway, guys, I know it's kind of like rambling on, but I figure I'll go ahead and make a little bit of a video about Marvel's, Marvel's Avengers because I normally don't, I normally don't talk about that a whole bunch, but I figure I'll go ahead and do something about that today. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys did, leave a like, subscribe to the channel if you guys are new, if you like the content I provide. Also, let me know who you think will survive in Avengers Infinity War, and also you're going to go see it. Um, if you have any more theories, then let me know in the comments down below, and I'll be seeing you guys on this video. And again, if you're new to the channel, consider about subscribing, and I'll be seeing you on the next one.